yeah, so I wanted to um, make a day in the life, but then I realized that today is not a very exciting life for me. Um, but instead, I wanted to um, talk about a topic that I care about a lot. Um, if I get any questions, which is not a lot, because I the question that like pops up a lot is like what motivates you what is your main motivation and stuff like that so I thought about answering that and with that like talking a bit about having off days and having anxiety and all that jazz so let's just like start with today which it's one of like the only days I have off from work so I was like I'm gonna make this like such a cool day I'm gonna go outside <coughs> sorry I'm gonna go outside play some Pokemon Go I'm gonna go to the um, take like a tiny little hike at the Viana Castle I'm gonna have so much fun first problem was I woke up at like 11 p.m. Which is really really late for me. I usually wake up at 9 and just with that I knew this was not going to be an awesome day. And then, um, and then I had like breakfast and lunch and all that. And I went to bed and I just slept for like... I slept... This is really bad. But I slept from 2 to... From 2 p.m. to like 5.30 p.m. So, I slept a lot, and I don't know what it is, but like lately I've been feeling like really anxious, probably because of my job. So now it's like almost 6 p.m., and I haven't done pretty much anything today. Now I'm still gonna go to the gym later on because I still have like a couple of hours to like. Um, to like sort myself out and go to the gym. Um, sometimes you just have like one of those days where no matter what you do, you're gonna feel like shit. I went to sleep at 1, 2 a.m. last night. So from 2 a.m. to 11 a.m. that is like, oh math, that's nine hours. And then from 2 p.m. to let's say 5 p.m. it's three hours so in total I had like 12 to 12 and a half hours of sleep today which is so much sleep so that's so much sleep so no matter how much coffee I drank this morning no much how much I had to sleep I'm still feeling like shit also I had so much carbs today so it's not even that it's not my diet it's just one of those days and everybody's gonna have one of those days now, if those days keep coming around every morning, then that's a problem. But if it happens like once a month, like it happens to me, or maybe once a week, then we can live with that. So, to answer the question, what motivates you or what is your main motivation? First of all, I'm not always motivated to go to the gym. Two out of five times, really not motivated to go to the gym. But, to be completely honest, I forced myself. I forced yesterday, and I forced the day before that, and I'm gonna force today. I don't know, I just, if you have like a goal in mind, let's say you, you wanna, I don't know, you wanna build a clothing company, but you have to go to this meeting, to this meeting, to this meeting, and to this meeting. And you're like, two out of these four meetings you don't really wanna go to. It's like, eh, I, I could rather stay at home and sleep in right now. But if you want to like achieve your goals, you have to go to all of these meetings. And chances are, sorry, chances are you're going to have to force yourself to go to these meetings. Now, if um, you have to always force yourself, it's not, I don't think it's healthy to keep like forcing yourself like for example I was studying English and for about a month I was physically and mentally forcing myself to go to college 
studying something I really didn't want to study. After that, I kind of like figured out, okay, this is completely not for me, and I dropped out of um, that college. But so a whole other story. Um, but the point of it is that sometimes you're not motivated to do this stuff, and you still have to. Um, but don't live your life on forcing everything. So what does actually motivate me? Number one, what motivates me is my progress. I have been like um, trying to like lose weight, tone up, fit myself up, whatever you want to call it. I've been trying to do that for like over a year now. So I have some comparison. When you're first starting out, starting out, this might not motivate you because it takes a while for your body to like show results. What else motivates me? The way I'm feeling motivates me. Like I know that once I get out of the gym, I'm gonna feel like bomb.com. I'm gonna have so many endorphins and I'm gonna be my happy self, which is kind of a problem that I go to the gym at night because then I'm just like, yay! And everybody's like, go to sleep. We want to sleep. Of course, like looking at other pictures, like Nikki Black hit her. Jasmine Garcia, um, Emily Duncan, Emily Hayden, Amanda Bucci. For a while I was like really stuck on watching videos and as soon as I watched them I'm like I'm so pumped let's go and I went to the gym or like worked out at home. Um, no that doesn't do the trick as much because I work, I see so many videos. Um, so watching other people just kill it. Um, uh, on like social media that inspires me oh just like watching like when I go <laughs> with um, my sister she is um, she sometimes goes with me uh, not like this week because she is um, on vacation but when she goes with me she's much stronger than me so that like pushes me like she oh my god I just I can't believe she's always been like I can't do this, I can't do this. Like she can't pick herself up from a push up, but she can like do all sorts of stuff that I'm like, I, I, I'm dying. You need to motivate yourself. You need to force yourself or find what motivates you. What motivates me might totally not motivate you. Also remember you're not gonna have a motivating positive days every day because life happens. With that, um, I hope this helped somebody. If not, that, that sucks. I just spoke for like 15 minutes for no reason. But <laughs> I hope it helps somebody. Uh, so at the end of the video, I'm gonna don't, have some workout footage yet. from today. That if, if I don't get myself to gym today, I'm gonna be really depressed. Um, so hopefully there's workout footage starting for now. Hello! Wanted to do a voiceover for this video. I did HIT cardio or HIT, whatever you want to call it. I did 20 seconds of um, sprinting, 20 seconds resting, and I did it for 5 minutes incline. I think it was 5 and speed 12. Um, just a little bit of cardio. Here I'm trying to find weights because some people do not know how to act in gym. Um, doing some rows. I, by that point, I really thought it was gonna be a good workout. I was trying to like pump myself up, but it turned out to be SHIT. As you can see, by this time, I realized this is not gonna be a great day. Um, there's like no weights on that machine. I don't know what that machine is called, but there's no weights on it. It's pretty much just really, really light. But I was just so weak. I really wanted to this to be like an inspirational video, like, yeah, you can have bad days and still go to the gym and just kill it, and it just didn't turn out that way. <laughs> I have had a shit day and a shit workout, but I had to push through it and I mean I did it but it was not great. Next we did some overhead presses um, also with no weight because I'm a weak human being. 
uh, I don't know, also it's a Smith machine, so I could, I mean, that's weak, come on people. Um, hopefully somebody saw me and was like, this girl needs help. Probably that's what happened. Next we did some um, tricep pushdowns, I was actually doing more weight than I realized because I guess I don't know how to read weight um, but it was still pretty hard for me. Next we have tricep pushdowns, cable, whatever and here you can see me readjust the weight because it was too freaking heavy for my weak, weak body. Um, we did, I did three sets of 12, all of these exercises, I did three sets of like 10 to 12 reps. Here's just from another angle, like isn't it so sad watching that weight go up and down so long, so lonely. Lonely, I'm so lonely. Here you can see um, side letter lore, side oh my god, side raises, <laughs> um, it was, that was, that, this exercise wasn't that bad, so, I did that, then, I did this machine, I don't know what's called, I should probably, like, check at the gym when I go today, but, yeah, I did that, trying to hype myself up, it did not work, the music was also really shitty at the gym. I mean, what can you do? Struggle bus. I was really struggling during all of this. Maybe you can't see it, but I was really struggling. The last exercise I did was bench press. As you can see, no weight. Still pretty hard pretty wobbly so if I put weight on it it would probably just just collapse on me um, that was pretty much it that was like the last exercise hope you enjoyed this video give it a thumbs up like comment and subscribe and hopefully I'll see you in my next one bye you better love me again.